Hello friends, I hope you are doing good. Today I am going to cover a very interesting topic that is case versus decode. Okay, see most of the time when I have asked this question in interviews, usually I have uh, got the response that okay, case uh, can handle complex logic, decode cannot, case can also use arithmetic operators like more than, less than, but decode cannot. But there are other differences as well which I have not heard very much in the interviews. Okay, but before jumping on that, I would like to ask one very simple question. That is, can you give me the output for select decode null comma null comma zero comma one from dual? So, see, uh, I hope that you would say that, okay, null cannot be compared with null in Oracle. So its answer is going to be one. Okay, right? But that is wrong. So let's see why. So let's see the differences. Okay. So now nulls are handled differently. It means uh, there are some cases where the code will handle the null differently and case will handle the null differently. Now case can also have some predicates, for example in parameter. Case can be used in PLSQL construct. It means that, uh, see the code can be called in a set statement, right? As a function you can use it, even in the PLSQL, but uh, case can be used as a standalone construct. So I will give you the example. Now case can be used as a parameter to call the procedure and then the code can handle type mispatches as well. So now uh, let's see the example one by one. Now coming back to the original question, right? Let's find out. Select the code null comma null comma zero comma one from dual. Okay. So see, the answer is zero. So basically, in the code null is equal to null okay so remember so now let's take example of case so there are two type of cases basically searchable case and a simple case so select case when so select case null when null then zero else one okay and from dual so see in this case where you are comparing null with the with null the answer is one okay but in case of decode the answer was zero consider a second example where we will see that how in can be used as a predicate in case and how the arithmetic operators can also be used so salary more than ten thousand i am using over here and then first name i am uh, saying that Steven, Nina and Lex, if those are present in a first name, then we will display something. So that is top and average. So see, if you see over here, there are two different case statements, right? So I am using two case statements. So one case is for the salary and the other case statement is, is for the first name. Okay, so now, uh, okay, for the first we will display higher paid and average paid. For the other one, I, we will display top and average. Now let's try to run the query. Okay, so if you see Steven, Nina and Lex, right, both are there in the third one, oh, sorry, in the second case. So, top is getting displayed and since they are also uh, having salary more than 10,000, so higher paid is coming for them. So, similarly, uh, case can have these two options, okay. But in decode, there is no such option. So, now, now let's see the third difference. That is, in the PLSQL block, how a case can be used as a standalone thing, as a constructor, okay. So, see. If you see over here, so I have taken one variable, okay, A, and then I have uh, assigned some value to this, and then I have simply written case statement. So if case is A, when A, then we will uh, display correct. If it is B, we will display incorrect, okay. That's a very simple PLSQL block. So let's first of all run this one. So it is saying incorrect because it is comparing this B with B. So now let's write a over here okay now let's see so in this case if you see correct is coming so this is how the case is working over here okay so 
it means that uh, in PL SQL also this case can work as a standalone. Okay. Okay. Now I will uh, try to create one procedure and we will try to use case as a parameter. So if you see over here, create or replace procedure P case. I am inserting one number over here, and then I am trying to print it out. When I am saying inserted, it means in other parameter. So let's first of all create this procedure. Okay. So this is a very simple procedure. It is created. Now how you can call it, right? So there are two things. Even if you write directly some value over here, right? Three. So it will work. So that is a very conventional use. Now, if you want to use decode, right? So we will see that example as well. Now, if you if you are writing case, right? In this case, if I write something, so it is asking me for some uh, bind variable. So let me write it down a. Okay, sorry, not a, but three. So if you see over here in this example, it is saying that uh, old uh, begin and new begin. So I think you are not able to see it. So let me run it one more time. Three. Hmm? See, so anonymous block is completed, and the answer is one. It means when you it is comparing three with. Uh, 3 and then the answer is 1. So if I run it one more time with some other value suppose 2 so it will display you 0 over here right. So we are able to use the case over here but now if you ask me to use decode right decode um, and a comma 1 comma 1 comma 2 okay. So if I try to run this 3 so what it is saying function or pseudo column decode may be used inside a SQL statement only ok. So now let us see the last difference that is type mismatch so select decode let us compare 1 with where care thing okay sorry character thing and then output would be is one is equal to then two else zero hmm? from dual so this is working pretty fine now select case when select case one when one then two else 0 ok from dual so same statement I am using so it is saying that inconsistent data type expected number got care so this is something which oracle internally handles in decode maybe it is a function but in a case statement you will get the type mismatch error so your data types should be totally correct so guys these are five major differences uh, I would say in case and decode I hope this would be very helpful अगर आप चैनल सब्सक्राइब करते हो तो गाइस थोड़ा मोटिवेशन मुझे और मिलेगा थैंक यू